Lagos takes up on the drive. With Drew Long goes, drives, draws the contact, makes the layup. I'm very excited. Um, once the opportunity came about, my corner and I thought that it made the most sense. Looking at the tradition, the atmosphere in the gym after I played here last year, um, everything just seemed like it made sense. And once everything got done, you know, I couldn't be more excited to be here. Uh, what were the main reasons heading to Konas for the next year? Some of the main reasons were just hearing about the traditions of, you know, the basketball club here. Um, you know, it's at the forefront of the city. Um, it's, it's, it has an incredible second to none fan base behind it. And everybody that I've spoken to that has been here in the past has always said that once they, you know, come here, they get better as a basketball player and as a man. And um, those are two things that, you know, I'm standing by and uh, made me really excited to be committed. Uh, last season, you played with uh, two former Jalgiris players, Brandon and uh, Kevin. Did you take their advice on, on coming to Konas? Yeah, um, Kevin and Brandon had just as big as influence as anybody in regards to me committing here. Um, they were raving about the club, they enjoyed their time. Um, and again, they were two of the people who said to me once they left here, they became better men, better players. And uh, for me, that was all I needed to hear. The most memorable thing for them was just pay playing in front of the fans, um, just having complete access to the basketball facility, being able to get in there late nights, early mornings. Um, but they, they always say that they remember the games and how they could compete. And no matter what, the fans were never too hostile, but always there willing to push and be behind to show support. So that was something that I thought was great. You mentioned that uh, gym access uh, anytime. Uh, you like to work hard alone and uh, put this extra work? Yeah, that, that, that's me. Um, anybody who knows me from since I was a kid till now, um, I believe in hard work. I believe, you know, if you're blessed with all your limbs and you know you're able to breathe and wake up every day, uh, that you can get anything you want with the hard work that you put in. Um, so having gym access to me is, is my remedy, man. That's, that's all I really need. Uh, it's quite symbolic that your best EuroLeague game so far was against Jalgiris here in Konas. How do you remember that game? Um, I remember getting two early fouls in the first half and being pissed off because the atmosphere was so crazy, the gym was so hot, the lights were so bright. It was a game that I just wanted to be a part of from the beginning to the end. And uh, I remember coming out of the halftime thinking to myself, I want to make an impact and give us at least a chance to win this game. And um, I just remember the fan base being insane, man. Uh, Keenan hitting a couple big shots, the team just staying kind of cohesive. And again, having the fan base behind them was amazing. Uh, do you thrive playing in that kind of atmosphere? I believe I do. Um, I played in the Big 12. Uh, again, Keenan is familiar with that, playing at Texas Tech. I was at Iowa State and every night, uh, you know, was packed out, sold every single night. Not a seat in the house was empty. Um, it was something that kind of made me take that step and be ready for my professional career. And I believe those are the environments that I play the best in. Uh, Jalgiri showed underdog attitude last season and went to EuroLeague playoffs. Uh, are you ready to bring the same attitude and mentality next season? Absolutely, absolutely. Um, that's why I committed to play here. Just seeing the way that they did it together um, after talking to coach. You know, those are all the things that I kind of stand by and I'm ready to just contribute and do all I can to help us win more games. What was your first impression about the coach? What did you guys talk about? Very diligent, um, knows what he stands by, uh, very big on his philosophy as far as committing ourselves to defense and, uh, you know, giving guards the freedom to play. If you play hard on the defensive end and you show that you're giving it up for the team, he'll be willing and able to allow you to play your game. And uh, that's something that, that, that I signed by as well. Uh, how would you describe yourself as a basketball player for our fans that maybe don't know you that well? Um, I would say I'm a bigger size guard. Um, I'm a point guard who can also play the two as well. So, I mean, you consider that as a, as a combo guard. Um, I play with a lot of uh, emotion. Um, I'm not somebody who, who has any type of uh, filter in regards to just the way I feel or, or the passion I have for the game. Um, I respect and love the game and, uh, you know, I can stand by anybody who, who feels the same. I'm somebody who takes pride in defense and, uh, again, I'm a bigger size guard, so I think I like to use that to my advantage. Aggressive defense of Madrid as they close out. Long shot from Mitchell Long and he makes it rare. 